Hello everybody, this is the Salty Bun bringing you another Modern Warfare 3 Osprey Gunner and today it is going to be with the UMP on the map Village. I was using the outload of the Predator Missile, H6 Overwatch, and of course the Osprey Gunner. And today I am going to talk about the Sony PS4 or also known as the Orbis right now. We're not certain if this is going to be the code name or if this is actually going to be the name, the PlayStation Orbis. Uh, there's speculations that it could be called that or it is going to be called the PS4. There's not a whole lot of knowledge or facts on which one it's going to be, but there is reports if it's going to be the Orbis, it makes sense because it with the connection of the Vita and the Orbis in Latin, I guess it means the circle of life. And so if you think about it, the Vita is going to be hooked up with the Orbis like it is now with the PlayStation 3. And it will be like the circle of life. So you'll be able to play on the PS4 and the Vita. So there's that. And they're also saying that the Orbis is going to be released around Christmas time in 2013 but there's also been other reports that it was going to be released in 2014 but PlayStation back when they created the PS3 they said that it was a 10 year console and they weren't gonna start developing or thinking of developing one for 10 years so that would be 2016 because the PlayStation 3 came out in 2006 which seems like a while ago I mean it's been six years and you think that a new console would be coming out but uh, yeah they said that it was gonna be a 10 year console and I'm looking at a website right now and it says that the Orbis is going to take away all like used games. It will not be compatible with any used games and it will not be capable of playing PlayStation 3 games anymore. When the PlayStation 3 first came out, they said that the PlayStation 3 was going to be able to play your old PS2 games and then they slowly got rid of that chip that was in the PlayStation 3 and they like disabled it or whatever it was. So that kind of sucks. And another thing is, is only one PlayStation Network account will be linked with the game. So if you have, say, like two accounts, like I personally have two accounts on my PlayStation that I play on. One's the Salty Bun, the other one is the Salty Biscuit. And that one is just like my mess around, have fun with account. They're saying that you'll have to buy the game twice in order to play it on both PlayStation accounts and if you ask me I think that is kinda stupid because I personally play on two accounts and it's just it's gonna be kind of a hassle to make sure you have to buy two games at sixty dollars a piece like that's gonna be annoying but I hope that it ends up adapting to be like Steam where you can just buy the game offline or online or whatever and make it download onto your console and they're saying that that's gonna be the case because the hard drive is going to be bigger and there's going to be more stuff to go on to that. And if you guys want to know more about this, just type it in Google and there's some sites that they mention this. And yeah, so we're going to do the would you rather question of the day. Would you rather have nobody show up to your wedding or would you rather have nobody show up to your funeral? Now, personally, I don't care if you show up to my funeral or my wedding because either way, I hope I'm going to be in peace because if I get married to the girl of my dreams, she's going to light up my world and I don't care if there's anybody around me because my, all my attention is going to be on her. And my funeral, I'm dead. Who cares? I guess I'll get over it. So thanks guys for watching and just remember to have a nice day, everybody.